Good morning, everyone, and welcome to another week of Butchering Tips with Berkey. Here we have, we've got our blade roast here. We're just going to cut the oyster off it. Just for a hot tip, the oyster blade is Berkey's favourite cut of steak. Anyway, we'll just take the bark off the bottom of it, as you can see there, clean the bottom up, and now we're just going to poke the knife in underneath the fat layer on the um, top of the oyster blade and we're going to take that off and what that does it takes the fat off it and as you can see the uh, shell of the oyster down the bottom there you can see some silver so we're going to take that off now that also I've taken off for the rest of that with the bottom of that fat on the top so we'll just clean up the sides a little bit and then we tip them over and um, now we're going to cut our oyster blade steak so we just take the first slice off there and we take that butterfly that oyster blade's beautiful I actually like it just grilled grilled quickly on the barbecue and I like it when it gets up to the end as it gets a bit grislier but it's really good um, grilled it's got a lot of flavor in it it's a lean steak and um, makes a perfect casserole too so absolutely beautiful it is as you can see they're great looking pieces of meat um, and now we're going to come back to the blade here so this is the whole blade so we're just going to clean off the um, the bottom of the blade there um, this piece of meat here which is actually attached to around about the bottom of the brisket there would be coming from that as well and the bottom of the beef rib um, so we're cleaning up the silver off that and the fat off that now we can use that for numerous of things we can use that for trim uh, we actually dice a lot of this for our dice blade um, it makes a really good dice product because it's not a tough piece of meat and it's um, very full of flavor um, when you've cleaned it up correctly anyway so we're just going to lightly clean that up there and um, the fair chance that'll go into someone's pies that's going to get cut for an order this afternoon let's take the bottom of the point off there now with this blade here we're going to take a bit off the bottom all this has got silver on the bottom of it with a roast we leave it on for the roast um, and you've got the end piece here which is a bit full of grisly there so we take that off too this makes it a bit more enjoyable now you can use these blades uh, for numerous things you can use them for barbecue steaks nizzles beef strips anything if you're going to use that you do clean up that silver off the bottom but we're just going to do beef roast and we're just going to cut it in half here we're going to get two nice roast out of it as you can see and enjoy your day